It's not often you get an elephant in the mail, but if you work here, it happens all the time. They'll come to us rock hard from Africa. Back in that back box would be a life-size elephant. There's another life-size elephant down below and hippos and, and rhinos and all kinds of different uh, types of animals. It's just it's amazing that uh, this type of work is coming to us. The commercial tannery has seen sales more than double for the past three consecutive years, earning them the title Mid-Michigan's Small Business of the Year. The company recently added three employees to the payroll and up to 10 more people will be hired in December. That's when it all really starts coming in real heavily and that'll last until about the end of March. I mean, just inundated with skins daily, semis dropping off and UPS and FedEx. It's awesome. It's something that I've never done before um, and I'm just by talking with Mark, we know it's going to grow. We know we're going to get bigger and I can't wait. The heights come from all over the world, New Zealand and Africa, to name a few places. Hunters pay up to $80,000 for a license to kill these exotic animals and pay thousands more for the taxidermy process, which includes rehydrating, shaving, oiling and grooming. Some of them will go into museums, um, but most of them will go into the homes of these hunters. Uh, they have very large homes or whatever, and they want to display those, the, the, depict the, the hunt that they were on. In Reed City, Lorne Amstutz, 7 and 4 News.